Hey y'all, peace and earth, love and light to you. This is Virgo's monthly reading for the month of July 2018. So this time you're going to pick your message and it's either going to be from deck. Um, this deck here, this is the Whispers of Lord Ganesha deck by Angela Hartfield. And this is my Spirit Messages deck by John Holland that I'm so happy that I found because I my thought I had lost this deck. So. Um, be led to either one. This is a rose chorus. This is a citrine. However, you're going to be led. You might be led to both of them this time. But I'm going to start with this citrine first. I'm going to see what your message is for the month of July. Virgo. Virgo. So, this is your message. Immediately, I heard to focus. Yes, immediately I heard focus for the month of July. And I think that's what your focus needs to be. This is just more going to be for you, Virgo, for the month of July. This is just what you need to focus on. Um, the message that I'm about to give you now. But I'm he also hearing the word focus. And I think that I just see a lot going on for you in the month of July. That you're going to really need your spirit guidance from. And I'm thinking that's why this card is here. When I get this card, it's just it's also it's always just saying um, certain things, and it's usually about your shh. So my little Virgo child is she just wants to show up right now. But anyways, <laughs> she was doing the same thing in a Capricorn video, but this Hello Fray from Kevin card is usually just is um. It's a card that's usually saying anything about spiritual guys or your spiritual team trying to get a message to you. And that's what I feel right now. They're trying to get a message to you. In the month of July, you're going to have to just um, not more so get a message to you. But they really just want you to really incorporate them more in the month of July. Because I see that and feel that you're just going to have a lot going on for you in the month of July. And I think they're going to send you different signs and symbols and synchronicities and stuff. So if some of you are having um, any issues to do with your children, then this is a month to really put um, focus on them. And I do feel like some of you guys have been praying for your children when it comes to certain things. And this situation is going to turn out for the best. And um, I'm also seeing um, a sick child that's going to be healed in this month also. And uh, unless some of you probably don't know and, you know, maybe something like that starts to happen and then you wonder what go what's going on. But I'm going to tell you right now, if you don't know yet, and this is the issue that has to be with, with your child, I'm just hearing all this well. And anything you need, just don't get prideful, okay? Because sometimes you Virgos can be like that. I know, because Tauruses can too. And just um, just ask. Spirit saying anything you need, just ask. If it's guidance or whatever it is. And I feel like this is more so of a spiritual thing. That some of you guys are just actually um, wondering and thinking about a lot. When it comes to spiritual things. And they're saying just ask anything that you want to know. And this is going to be your f main focus for the month of July. And just make sure. Some of you make sure you take you some clear. Some um, a spiritual bath. And just continue to remain focused. But really that's what this cleanse card is here. It's just by saying remain clear and cleansed and focused for the month of July. I just feel like a lot of things is going to be coming at you. And they're going to want you to know. And they want you to know that you should just call on them more for the month of July. I see your month being kind of hectic. So continue to focus. Um, be very careful. Just continue to dot every I and cross every T. Okay. So that is all for you Virgos when it comes to that deck. And so for all of you who are led to the Whispers of Lord Ganesha deck or this Rose Quartz, let's see what your message is. Okay, so the first thing that I heard, Virgo, was balance. And um, for the last couple of readings when I did Taurus and Capricorn, the messages on both sides has been similar. This is similar also. And so maybe some of you are just going to be led to both both decks of cards because this is very similar. 
this nurture card is here just like the other one just like the child card came out on the other one and um sometimes i interpret this as saying um don't forget to take care of yourself and treat yourself as if you would do your child and i am saying that because i hear that message clearly too because in the month of july you're gonna have to keep it balanced i see a lot coming at you in the month of july but don't be afraid don't worry you have divine support to get you through this continue to call on your spiritual guides to get you through this month i see a lot coming at you virgo in the month of july and also this is also something that has to do with a child or your children just make sure in the month of july well first i think some of you have just been praying for them so just know that all is well whatever it, this situation is going to be and whatever you want for them i think some of you are just wanting more more for your children or something like that in the month of july i just see a lot of things turning around for you when it comes to your children some of you have been praying to get certain things for them or something certain things that you desire for them and spirit is just letting you know that this is going to happen but remain balanced remain clear remain focused that's why this clear energy card is here because spirit wants to remind you to stay positive keep a positive mind for the month of july virgo i see a lot coming at you that's the thing and it's just um something that comes coming to just disturb your peace but you have divine support here um everything is going to be okay everything is going to be all good do not be nervous because i feel like i'm picking up some nervous or anxiety anxious type um energy right now so spirit wants me to encourage you and let you know that everything all is well okay and if you have anything coming up maybe some kind of court hearing regarding your children don't worry about it. All is well for the month of July. And this will manifest into something good, something beautiful, okay? Just keep your energy cleared and keep your mind. Um, remember to stay balanced. Remember to just be extra careful and make sure you cross every I and dot every T. Make sure you read every fine print, okay? I just see something something just trying to come and and interrupt your peace or just interrupt your mind for the month of july virgo but everything will be all good as long as you continue to use your divine support okay remember that that's what they are there and that's what they are there for so um that is all you guys continue to come and grow with me and subscribe thank you all so much for those of you who have already subscribed and leave a comment let me know how well this resonated with you thank you bye